We're now going to do an H lookup. It does the same exact thing that a V lookup does. The only difference is the way it's set up. In a V lookup, you'll notice all the headings are across the top and of the columns and the data goes down the column. An H lookup, the headings are in the rows and the data goes across the row. So it's done horizontally instead of vertically. We're going to click in cell A7 and we're going to go to our formula bar look up a reference and we're going to look for that H lookup. Once you do, what we want to look up is what's in cell A5. We then want to look through the table that's over here on the right. So and ask us what table we want. We want this table over here on the right. And actually you want to start in column E. And then it's going to ask us, well, what do, you, what do you want me to put here in this yellow box? What's in column 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, or 6? Or what's in row 1, 2, or 3? And we want to know the commission percentage. So we're going to have it tell us what's in row 3. I'm going to put a 3 there. These dollar signs make it absolute. So that means if we were to ever copy this formula anywhere, we could use these dollar signs to ensure that these cell references would not change. It would always be E4 through J6. Another way to do this would be to name this range. And it tells me someone who makes $2,555 would get a 10% commission.